Nothing says fall time in Georgia like high school football on a Friday night. So what better time to showcase all the things agriculture has to offer a community in an event called the Appalachie Celebrates Agriculture Festival. Uh, we've got a, a Friday night football game where the community's going to be excited to come out anyway, and this just gives a little something extra uh, to allow those people to come out and have a good time, plus uh, see some different stuff and have an educational event too that's uh, family friendly. You don't spend a waking moment without interacting with it. Uh, the sheets you sleep on are made of cotton, uh, the stuff you eat every day, the leather on your car seat, everywhere you turn there's agriculture, and if you're not exposing people to it, they're not going to know where that stuff comes from. And that's the main reason for the event, as parents and students covered the lawn in front of the stadium, not only to see all the sights, but also gain an appreciation for the industry and those involved in it. It's an event designed to do a couple of things, showcase uh, our FFA chapter, to showcase uh, local Winder and Barrow County agriculture, to showcase Georgia agriculture, and also just give people the chance to come out and interact with the Appalachian community. And this event was all about community as a number of local businesses were more than happy to share their time with all in attendance. And one of those was Harrison Poultry, who has been a mainstay in the county. Well, we've been in this community since 1959. Uh, uh, we've started our chicken company that many years ago, Mr. Harrison did, and uh, agriculture is such a big part of uh, Georgia. And the chicken industry is the largest segment of that uh, agricultural business in Georgia. While poultry is a large driver for the economy, it is far from the only one. That's why it's so important to have a variety of vendors in attendance, including most of the major colleges. You know, in Barrow County and Northeast Georgia specifically, it's easy to focus on poultry. It's easy to focus on the beef cattle side of things, but there's just so much more. Um, and we want, uh, you know, students to have the options that the colleges that are out there for them once they graduate from here, uh, different businesses they can go into for work. Uh, it gives them a chance to interact too and spread their message, whether they're local, whether they're Georgia Tech or Fort Valley or Georgia, the different programs here. And with those degrees, there are plenty of opportunities to work in the agricultural field. It's a major reason why Harrison Poultry, who is the largest employer in the county, felt it was important to get in front of the next generation. Well, a lot of these students are our future. I mean, they're future, future employees of different businesses, and obviously we'd, we'd also like to see some of these high school kids come and work for us at Harrison Poultry with an ag background. Most of our um, employees have a poultry science degree of some sort or animal science degree of some sort, so uh, it's a big deal for us to just make kids aware that there's career in food and, and, and poultry. And it appears the future is in good hands as these FFA students enthusiastically volunteered their time to put on this unique event. You know, that makes all the hard work worth it when your kids are excited and, and when you, you know, when they're gone for the day or when you go home at night and you lay your head down and, and you think about how excited they are, that gets you excited and that gets you motivated to, to keep the hard work going and, and get up the next day and keep going at it. Reporting from Winder, I'm Damon Jones for the Georgia Farm Monitor.